Hi guys, just an ad be quick video. Um, if you look outside, you'll see that the fence has been done. Um, and my plan is those two posts there, I'm going to put a bit of wood across the top of them and grow some tomatoes in there. I'll fill it up with compost obviously and grow some tomatoes in there and grow them up there. I think that'll be good because the sun will be over there. And another wee thing I want to talk about is, if we go to the grass, I put down that Westland lawn feed and weed and I put it down on Saturday. I got it, the wife brought it in for me on Friday and I put it down on Saturday. Um, and as you can see, it's really working. I mean, look, half of these stuff are going, these weeds are going black. The moss is dying. And basically, you can see the grass. So I am, there is still some there. I might have to redo it again, but I'm going to leave it for another week and see what happens. I might have to buy more. But so far I'm impressed. Okay, let's get back in. It's too cold outside. And if we come across into the grow room, I was watching a video from uh, is it Rob's allotment and gardening in the attic? Um, well, in fact, I'll show you rather than explain to you. Anyway, there's my basil. This is my basil roots, my basil cuttings. And they're really starting to root. Doing well. Lettuce. This is the chard I was talking about. And this is Lolo Rosso lettuce. These are flowers. Still my herbs. But if you come up here... And we look in there, guess what that is? That's Lobelia. And that's a different type of Lobelia. Now, I didn't know, me being me, I just thought you'd, you know, you'd just sow them like flowers. <laughs> but then I watched Rob's um, video. And he said, and he mentioned that he puts them in to these things, uh, module trays. And now that I think about it, when I think of labelia, I think, yeah, that makes sense. So I've done it wrong. So don't do what I've done. What I'm going to have to do, I think, is to get some light in there, is wait till they get bigger. And then try and get them out with a fork, a spoon or some sort of handle. And then try and get them into module trays. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if that's going to work. But anyway, I might just buy more seeds and put more seeds in. I'll see. But otherwise, that's all that's been happening lately. My onions have started coming up. My red onions at the back there. You can see the wee white spot. They're coming up. This is more flowers, but they're coming up. A bit leggy looking. This is pansies, and they've started to come up. Lobelia and Lobelia. I don't really have much more do going on at the moment. Um, but that's about it, I think. Yep, yeah, that's about it. Okay, that's about it. I think that's all I can talk about today. There's not much going on. Um, so, thanks for watching. Catch you later. Bye-bye. Please, please keep safe. Bye-bye.